Hey guys, we're on our way to Lake Como. It's about 8 a.m. in the morning and only uh, one degree out. Say hi. Hi. <laughs> we're going on to Lake Como. We're waiting for the tramway to catch the train and to have a fun and very long day to Lake Como. Before we get going, be sure to subscribe and like the video. to visit and it's also a very wealthy area as well. Many famous people have houses here such as Madonna, George Clooney, Richard Branson and even Sylvester Stallone as well as many others. It is easy to take a day trip from Milan to Lake Como as there are two train stations in Como. However, you can only leave your luggage at one of the stations at the San Giovanni station and as of now it costs 5 euros per bag per day. We also saw the Christmas market at Como, which again was full of all types of cheeses, meats, pizzas, cookies, and strudel. Just went inside the cathedral and you can't take any photos, so right now I'm just taking videos from the outside, but it's very impressive. It's enormous on the inside though, absolutely enormous, full of tapestries and paintings and murals and mosaics. And it's pretty cold here right now in Lake Como. We're here in Como, so it's a little cold, maybe it's 4 or 6 degrees in winter, so make sure you bring your winter clothes. We wanted to go to Bellagio, that is one of the most important little villages and but the thing is that we missed uh, the first boat so we had to wait to the second boat. Today is Sunday, we don't know if there's just two boats that runs but then finally we have to take the bus and then maybe or hopefully we're taking the boat to come back to Como and then come back to Milan. just arrived in Bellagio after about an hour and a half bus ride and it's a better idea to take the bus than to drive because most of the streets are just very narrow so they're hard to get around. And we're taking the boat back and there's only two boats today. It's also a little expensive, about 15 euros per person. But those are the only two options unless you want to rent a car. So we really recommend you to buy the tickets ahead of time if you have the possibility through online. Because if not, maybe you cannot take one of the boats that we wanted to take early in the morning at 11 because everything was booked out. If you are on a budget and decide to visit Bellagio as we did, it may be a good idea to eat before you go or to bring snacks as Bellagio is more expensive than Como and the place that we ate at in Bellagio was not worth the price.
It's a little more expensive when you go to places like Bellagio and it is a good idea to check ahead of time to make sure that you have the tickets for the boat if you want to take a boat as we couldn't take the boat earlier today and we had to take the bus to Bellagio and then we had to take the boat back but it was already dark so we couldn't see anything but anyway I'll see you tomorrow morning in Florence be sure to like the video down below and to subscribe.